Hello everybody! Today it's still a, a how-to, I don't know if you can see me. There you go. Oh. <laughs> I don't know if... if uh, well, what I'm doing today is kind of a how-to. Basically I just bought an HD camera and I need more light in my kitchen area which is behind the camera. So I found this old um, must be an chip. Anyway, it's just those big bulb. I'm gonna show it to you. It's dirty, but you know those kind of bulbs. Bulbs. Anyway, so it's a big lamp like that. Luckily, mine. Yeah, I can screw it. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna turn it into a spot. Just by taping it like that, and it's gonna work pretty good. <laughs> yeah. Now I thought about using some pieces of wood like that, just to stabilize it a little bit. As you can see, these are the little thingies you get to mix paint. So yeah. Just me uh, being cheap, because you know I could have just went on, gone to the store and bought uh, those cheap spotlights that they sell in the renovation sections of the store. But you know, why buy it when you can make it yourself? Plus I've got this old lamp not doing anything. Of course you could have uh, had screws and metal plates and all that stuff but I kinda I don't want to ruin the lamp because maybe I'm gonna have to need it one day and just in case I do buy a spotlight and make some noise I'm not gonna have ruined the lamp yeah so anyway you don't have to be uh... <laughs> there you go by the way, this is duct tape, the handyman secret weapon. A must in every house. Yeah. Just strap it as tightly as you can. And it should work pretty okay. If it doesn't, I'll go buy a real spot. <laughs> yeah. Now, how am I gonna do this? There you go. I guess I'll just go crisscrossing my tape. Like I said, I was pretty lucky because this particular lamp just unscrew so I just had to tug on the the extension cord or the cord whatever and it came out pretty easily and yeah and when I lit it up kind of blinded myself so I guess it should make a pretty good spot Yeah, I'm just gonna give it a few twirls here. My duct tape keeps breaking, I don't know why. Maybe tugging too hard or because it's cheap duct tape. And the best part about this, if my mom wants her lamp back, well, I can give it her back. I can give it back to her. Yeah. This should be enough. Whoop. I'm just gonna take it right there. So I can plug it. Turn the knob. There we go. It's not too bad. Look at that. Now, like I said, I could have unscrewed this part. But I was afraid it would get too too hot and maybe cause the uh, the duct tape's glue 
maybe to become less uh, less tacky and fall and it would all break and all that stuff so I'm just gonna put it on the chair and damn look at that before after but then again I'm kind of far from the kitchen so yeah <laughs> I just might have to get another spot but it does a pretty good job not sure if you can see the light no spot with the spot so yeah that's my little how to today no I just saved you uh, I don't even know 30 bucks <laughs> now but seriously like instead of I don't know wasting that and then not using it and buying something else well I'm just finding another use for it you can see it's a uh, not going anywhere so yeah that's it for today homemade spotlight for your uh, home studio <laughs> see you later